welcome to the science show. Today we are looking at irreversible and reversible changes. Today we are looking at irreversible and reversible liquid disorders. Back to liquid with, um, with an egg. Let's get started. We are now heating the liquid egg into a solid egg. How are you going to turn the egg back into a liquid? We're going to put it in the fridge and see if cooling works. We're going to put the egg in the fridge to cool it. Is it time to take the egg out? It's been in there for 20 minutes. Wow, top crackles. We'll worry about that ne um, next experiment. Now, let's take the egg out. Cooling the egg didn't work. Heating made it soft. A solid egg, some egg has irreversible change. Um, so the egg can't fit in. Thank you very much. We just looked at eggs. Now are you two looking at chocolate, not the one from Australia, the yummy one from England. It is solid. The chocolate is now liquid. We are going to put it on the plate and then put it in the freezer. Hopefully that will turn it into a solid. Now we have enough chocolate. Change. We've just looked at chocolate. What are you looking at? I am looking to see if rice has irreversible and reversible changes. In 30 minutes, the rice will be cooked. Asa, the rice is ready. Now the rice has been cooked. It has gone from hard to soft. Aisha, now what are you going to do? I'm going to put the rice on this tray to make it dry. Aisha, I think you have a problem. Rice is sticking together. I'm going to put it in the oven to dry it out. It might stop sticking together. Wow, that's hot. The rice has just came out of the oven. Although it's dry, it's still stuck together. So rice has... Irreversible change. See you in next week's show.